We'll be leaving, um, departing Yuan on the 10th of February and arriving in Trenton on the 11th. Because as you will recall, we need to provide the manifest to the Chinese authorities within 24 hours. So we really want to make sure that at the end, because that would be uh, the third plane, as I call it, or the second Canadian plane, that all of those who may not have been able to go to the airport for whatever reason, whether they're personal, whether because uh, traffic or other logistics, that we give them enough time to say this is the second Canadian plane, so you have ample time to make sure you do all the preparation to get there. So I think it's a good thing because then people will be, we will make sure that everyone who wants to depart will have, uh, let's say, a third chance uh, to come back to Canada. Let's remember, there'll be Canadian left in Wuhan that have decided to stay. So we will continue to provide the services to, uh, to those Canadians who are there because uh, you've seen the number fluctuating over the week. Some people have just decided to stay. We had some this morning who were supposed to come back with us and just made a decision to stay. So we will make sure that we continue to provide consular assistance to these Canadians in Hubei and in one in particular.